In the rapidly changing world of defense technology, one of the most fascinating breakthroughs comes not from the skies or the seas, but from the ground. Imagine a four-legged robotic soldier, tireless, efficient, and always ready for deployment. This is no longer science fiction or it's a reality. Kenya, in 2026, has unveiled its advanced military robot dog, a machine designed not only for combat support but also equipped with an extraordinary feature, automatic self-refill and resupply capability. This development is part of a broader movement where nations around the world are investing heavily in robotics to give their forces an edge on the battlefield. For Kenya, a country looking to modernize its military and prepare for the challenges of future warfare, the robot dog is more than just a piece of equipment. It represents a leap into a new era of innovation where soldiers can count on machines to handle some of the most dangerous and demanding tasks. So, what makes the 2026 Kenyan military robot dog so unique? First, let's understand its basic design. The robot is modeled after the agility and mobility of a real dog. With four powerful legs and advanced balance systems, it can move across rough terrain climb small obstacles, and maneuver in environments where traditional vehicles would get stuck. Whether in deserts, forests, or urban settings, the robot dog can keep pace with troops, carrying supplies, surveillance systems, or even weapons. But here's the real game changer, its auto-refill system. Unlike earlier generations of military robots that needed to be manually recharged or refueled, this robot dog comes with an innovative self-sustaining design. Using a built-in energy harvesting mechanism, it can recharge itself from portable field stations or by docking with mobile supply drones. Imagine a situation where soldiers are deep in hostile territory. Instead of waiting for human-operated resupply convoys which are vulnerable to ambush or the robot dog can simply connect to its drone partner, refuel, and continue the mission without slowing down. This reduces risk to human lives and keeps operations running smoothly. In terms of practical use, the robot dog has multiple roles. One of its primary functions is logistics. It can carry ammunition, food, medical supplies, and communication gear. Each unit has a payload capacity of up to 150 kilograms, allowing troops to move faster without being weighed down by heavy packs. Beyond logistics, the robot is equipped with cameras, thermal sensors, and artificial intelligence software that allow it to scout ahead of soldiers. It can identify threats, mark potential ambush spots, and even transmit real-time battlefield data to commanders. For combat scenarios, the robot dog can also be fitted with light weapon systems, though Kenya emphasizes its role more in support than direct fighting. This approach ensures that the robot enhances soldier effectiveness without replacing the human element on the ground. Still. The option to mount defensive tools like non-lethal deterrents or even drones for air surveillance gives the machine remarkable versatility. Now, let's focus more on its autonomous capabilities. The 2026 version includes advanced AI navigation, which means it can follow troops, move independently along programmed routes, or respond to voice and hand signals. Unlike remote controlled devices that require constant operator attention, the Kenyan robot dog thinks for itself, reducing soldier workload. Its automatic obstacle avoidance and adaptive learning allow it to grow more efficient the longer it is deployed. The auto refill feature deserves special attention. This system uses two technologies wireless energy transfer and modular battery swapping. 
if the robot is close to a field station, it can recharge wirelessly within minutes. If in a more dangerous combat zone, a small airborne drone drops a modular energy pack that the robot can swap in automatically. This makes it one of the first military robots in Africa capable of continuous long duration missions without human interference. From a strategic perspective, this gives Kenya's forces a significant edge. Long endurance means fewer interruptions. Troops can rely on the machine for constant supply and reconnaissance. Enemy forces cannot simply wait it out or target slow moving convoys because the robot dog never stops. For peacekeeping missions across Africa, this also means humanitarian supplies can be delivered in areas too risky for human drivers. Looking at the global picture, Kenya's adoption of robot dogs places it in line with advanced military powers experimenting with similar technologies. The US, China, and European countries have been testing robot quadrupeds for years, but Kenya's emphasis on autonomous resupply reflects a localized solution to African challenges, where vast terrains and limited infrastructure often hinder operations. By focusing on self-sustaining systems, Kenya reduces dependency on vulnerable supply lines. Of course, such innovations come with debates. Some critics argue that the militarization of robots could raise ethical concerns, especially if weaponized. There are questions about whether AI-driven machines could misinterpret commands or cause unintended harm. Kenya's defense officials stress that strict human oversight remains central. The robot dog is a tool, not a replacement for human decision-making. Its commission is to save lives both by reducing the burden on soldiers and by keeping supply missions safe. Another important factor is cost. Developing such high-tech machines is not cheap, and skeptics wonder whether Kenya can sustain mass production. However, defense partnerships with international allies and local tech companies are expected to reduce expenses over time. In fact, Kenya's push for indigenous innovation may lead to export opportunities, where other African nations purchase similar systems for peacekeeping or border security. In terms of design durability, the robot is built to withstand harsh conditions. Its waterproofing allows it to wade through shallow rivers or operate in heavy rain. Its heat-resistant casing ensures it works even in scorching desert conditions. With low maintenance requirements, each unit can operate in the field for months before needing major servicing. Another interesting addition is its communication system. The robot dog doubles as a mobile signal booster, helping troops maintain communication even in remote areas where signals are weak. This could prove vital during counter-terrorism operations or humanitarian crises. As we look to the future, the 2026 Kenyan robot dog highlights a larger trend, the merging of artificial intelligence, robotics, and military logistics into one seamless system. While drones dominate the skies, ground-based robot dogs are quietly becoming the backbone of smart armies. They may not have the glamour of fighter jets or tanks, but their role in supporting soldiers is just as critical. Kenya's version, with its auto-refill capability, pushes the boundary of what such machines can do. It ensures that soldiers are never left without supplies that surveillance is always active, and that operations can continue day and night. It symbolizes resilience, adaptability, and forward-thinking air qualities that every modern military must embrace. In conclusion, the arrival of Kenya's 2026 military robot dog marks a significant milestone in African defense innovation. It represents the perfect blend of technology and practicality, 
designed to meet the unique challenges of the continent while aligning with global standards. From logistics to surveillance, from autonomous navigation to automatic resupply, this robot dog proves that the future of warfare isn't just about bigger weapons, but smarter support systems. For the soldiers on the ground, this machine is more than just a robo to it is a loyal companion, a tireless partner, and a silent guardian. As nations watch Kenya's bold experiment unfold, one thing is clear, the battlefield of the future will not just be fought by humans, but also by machines that think, move, and sustain themselves. And Kenya's robot dog is leading the charge.